Hi everybody, it's 4.30 in the morning and uh, my mate just picked me up and we are going to the airport and this is how it starts. This is how I say goodbye to Finland and leave for Swaziland. Berlin. So today has not been going so well for me. I have a high fever. I'm in a really severe back pain right now. But that's okay because I'm moving forward. Right now I'm beginning the second leg of my journey. Swaziland. Bye bye Berlin. Hello Abu Dhabi. Guys, I don't know if you can see that, but I've literally landed in Mos Eisley Airport. Correction space. We're gonna get a lot of hate for that one. So, I made it to Abu Dhabi Airport, but I gotta say I'm not feeling too good. My fever has gotten worse, my back pains have gotten worse. So I actually went and rented one of these sleeping coffins. So, today, it's like 40 degrees Celsius in here, but uh, hey, at least I get to lay down and nobody will steal my stuff. So, yay, I will be in Swaziland in, oh, a little, little less than 24 hours, so it's all gonna be worth it. No pain, no gain. One thing I've noticed that uh, when you're sick, <coughs> you don't tend to go really adventurous. So tonight's supper brought to me by good old Mickey D. Good morning. That is Africa. That right there is Swaziland, so it means that somewhere over there is my home for the next three months. So, I made it to Johannesburg. And I'm actually feeling quite alright. I'm fever's gone. My back doesn't hurt anymore as much. And uh, yeah, actually, I'm getting really close to Swaziland. Oh, I'm mean, really close. It's still about 12 hours till I'm actually at Swaziland. But right now, I'm just waiting for my friends who are coming in from London. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna have my mate here. In. Gonna have a blast. Hey, welcome to Johannesburg. Hey. Found my mates. We had a good lunch, and now we're just. Waiting for our bus ride, which is going to take us the rest of the way here from Johannesburg all the way to Mbappe, Swaziland. We finally got into our bus that's gonna take us to Swaziland and this is a great ass bus, you know. Look, they've made us some nice little lunch bags just for us. You know, at first 
when I got here in South Africa I was feeling like man I don't feel like I'm in Africa because basically this this kind of all looks like a, a Mediterranean country like Portugal or Greece or something like that but after I had been only six hours at the airport and I saw my first ever gangrious foot. Uh, a person came up to me walking and showed me his foot which had a huge chunk fallen off of it and I was like yay! But now I'm starting to feel a little bit like I, I may be not that far anymore. We got some emus there and uh, some kind of buffaloes and, and some kind of antelopes, I don't know which kind, but we're not in Kansas anymore. Hey, I've been traveling now for more than 39 hours, and guess what? I'm just now coming to the Swaziland border. I made it, just barely though, like five minutes ago there was a really close call with some herd of buffaloes. In Finland we have a severe problem with cars crashing into mooses, but never a herd of mooses and definitely not a herd of buffaloes. So that was quite interesting. But here we are, nonetheless. Mbababaan 24. We made it. <laughs> it's now... <laughs> we made it. It's six past nine local time. I have no idea what it's in Finland time. I guess it's the same. We are one so, behind. Something like that. So I've been up uh, traveling now for quite a bit longer than 40 hours. But we're actually in Swaziland. We made it. And that's all I got left in me. Ah, and tomorrow the adventure starts. Bye bye.